Good afternoon, everyone. Happy Thursday. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com doing yesterday's brand new release, 2019 Panini Diamond Kings Baseball. 12 box, pick your team number four from jazbeescasebreaks.com. That's the second half of the case. Remember, we marked it four, so we know it's from the same master case. A very big thank you to all of these lovely people for getting into the action. On the 11th, 12 box, pick your team four. This break takes about an hour, so kick back and relax. There's Andrew. Last spot mojo, thank you. And there's everybody else getting into it. Appreciate it. Good luck, my friends. See ya. That was gonna be a disastrous pull, but no, I saved it. Thought the box were gonna be all over the place. All right, so there's four, eight, and twelve boxes right there. Good luck, everyone. What do we have on TV right here? We've got got Pirates and Cubs on the television. Pirates playing okay baseball. Cubs not playing good baseball. Zeros. The bottom of the second. Got Joe Musgrove on the mound. I've got Joe Musgrove on my fancy team. Let's go, Joe Musgrove. My Dodgers got swept by the Cardinals today. They dropped the series finale 11 to 7. Ugly day for the not not a good day for the Dodgers bullpen. They give up two different leads. Two errors for uh, for the Dodgers. They're a little sloppy in the field. I guess Matt Weeters. That's right. Matt Weeters drove in three runs and stole a base. What's Matt Weeters doing? Stealing bases. Remember when Matt Weeters was like the next hot catching prospect? They're like, oh, Matt Weeters. He's the next Joe Maurer. Didn't happen. I feel like some injuries derailed him. Uh oh, Kyle Schroer. I also have Kyle Schroer on my fantasy team. What do I want to happen here? All right. First box. Good luck, everybody. So we'll breeze through these. We'll show these. All cards numbered 101 and up are short printed, so the stuff like this will ship. Other vet base won't ship. Obviously, these are considered inserts, they will ship. Rookie cards will ship. Frames, of course, will ship. And Justice Sheffield. What a patch. Nice. He'll ship. 16 out of 25. Corey Riley with the Mariners. I'm blanking on his brother's name. His, his uh, brother is in the Dodgers organization. Also a pitcher. Supposed to be pretty good. The Sheffield brothers. There's Juan Soto autograph. Nice. Jordan Sheffield. Thank you, Joe P. 10 out of 25, Juan Soto. Juan going to Juan. Juan Escabi Pena. Going Juan Soto. Nice. For the Nationals. Nice one, Juan. It's a great hit. I was, I was just about to ask if any of these inserts are autographed. Well, that just answered my question. Altuve framed. 
And it's two hits per box. So that auto and that Justice Sheffield Relic is your are your uh, your two hits for box one. Pick your team four. All right, next box. Good luck. So after getting swept by the, the Cardinals, my Dodgers will be coming home and facing the Brew Crew, who also got swept by the Angels. So the two your two NLCS, last year's NLCS teams meeting each other for uh, to find their find their first win in a number of days. We got a lot of good uh, Wisconsin people in our crew, so I'm sure they'll be some friendly trash talking during that series. Red shut out the Marlins five to nothing. A's beat the Orioles eight to five. Chris Davis, Chris Chris with a K, Davis, homers twice. Chris with a C, O for O for the day. Box. And we have Vlad Guerrero Jr. Nice. Two-color dual relic for the Blue Jays. Anthony K with the Blue Jays in pick your team four. Ricky Henderson frame. So Clayton Kershaw will be making his first start soon. First big league start of the season. And there's your auto. It's Reese Hoskins, one of the nicest autographs in the hobby. Jersey and autograph for the Fightin' Phils. Tyler Rose with the Phillies. Next box. A lot of early starts today. Oh, Thursday, travel day, so a lot of early early games. So other teams can, can get on the road and get to their next destination. Um, Indians shut out the Tigers four to nothing. Shane Bieber, Justin's brother, Shane Bieber, allowing only three hits in seven innings. Nice. The Biebs. Mariners homeward homeward in their uh oh nice Tyler Tyler's saying that's the whole reason why he brought the Phillies to get Reese Hoskins well there you go man congrats uh Mariners ladies and gentlemen homeward in their 15th straight game it's the first major league team to do so and they take down the Royals in extras seven to six in ten I don't think the Mariners have lost more than a couple games. 
two or three games this season. Fantastic start for them. Um, they will be challenged, though. I think their next meeting is in uh, Houston. I think they're meeting the Astros. So that's going to be kind of a benchmark to see, hey, are, are these Mariners for real or not? We'll find out. Let's find out what's in this box. These artist proofs will also ship too, of course. I was an insert anyway, which it would ship anyway. And Taylor Ward is our first autograph out of the box. 20 out of 99. Jonathan Best with the Halos. He got both LA teams. He has a, he has the Angels and my Dodgers. Nice Taylor Ward. Satchel Page. Satchel Page frame. And Jose Ramirez, Diamond Deco. I actually love the design of these Diamond Deco cards. For the Tribe, that goes to Mark Matson and the Indians. Game used material in there, too. A couple pieces of his lumber as well. Bryce Harper frame. Moogie Betts. And the next box. Couple games in progress right now. The uh, the Blue Jays. I have financial interest in the Blue Jays, and they are up five nothing on the Red Sox in the top of the third in Boston. Let's hope they hold on. Mets are leading the Braves in the top of the third, three to two. And uh, we have got we've got the uh, MLB networks playing Cubs Pir Pirates Cubs, and. Um, they're tied at zeros right now. We're st still early in the break, Jonathan Best. We still have a lot of boxes to go. So have like 45 more minutes left in the break. I wouldn't, I wouldn't worry until there's like three boxes left. <laughs> then you could be like, hey, where's the hits, man? I'm getting nervous now. Still need to find a Dodger. I feel like we haven't seen very many Dodgers pop out of here yet thus far. All right. Next box. Good luck. That's gonna that's gonna tip over. It's Anthony Rizzo. <laughs> Diamond Deco, Juan Soto, another one for Juan. And the Nationals, nice. He's got his autograph earlier, and now his Diamond Deco, quad relic. Now we're looking for the autograph. And it's Kristen Stewart, two color relic, two color dual relic, 
and autograph. Nice. He's hoping to be part of the Tigers Youth Revival. That goes to Chris Miller and the Tigers. Would it cost you more to have you ship the filler cards? No, it wouldn't. We wouldn't ship the filler cards. <laughs> There's Yelich. Our shipping team ends up using these a lot. All right, Mr. Mike Daddy, what's going on? Sorry about Seeger. What happened? He exited the game early. He got hit in the hammy. But is there additional news? Is he dead? I hope not. <laughs> did, his, did his leg fall off? He played a couple innings after. He seemed fine. I think they they only lifted him for precautionary reasons. Hopefully he's not... Hopefully there hasn't been any additional news. Spelling disaster. Should be fine. Has there been initial news, Mr. Mike Daddy? Getting injured. I got, oh, you don't know how bad it was. Oh, okay. He got me nervous. Got me thinking that there was some news announced after the game that he his leg fell off or something. I didn't realize Muncie got her. What happened to Max Muncie? And we've got Kyle Wright for the Braves. Nice. When you're right, you're right, Patrick Kay. He got the Braves. Labor Torres frame. And we've got Warren Spahn out of 25. Nice. This is Milwaukee Braves, right? Warren Spahn? He was never anywhere. He was never on a Brewers team, right? Yeah, he was always a brave. Okay. There's the babe, card number three, frame. And we've got Bat Kings. Bat Kings. That goes to Mike Grego and the Oakland A's. Caleb Ferguson for my Dodgers. There's Patrick Wisdom for the Rangers. It's getting close. Next box. 
You're welcome, Grego. First, first of many, I hope. Almost halfway through this break, folks. After this box, we will be halfway through. Is Warren Spawn still with us? He is. He's 82 years old, folks. Turn 82 in last November. All right, next one. Three hundred wins is not going to happen, right? Again. I feel like with with so with pitchers not pitching as deep in the games anymore. I mean, people are starting to experiment with, with openers. Teams going to bullpens earlier. A lot of specialists, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. I I just don't think there's going to be like it used to be. All right, three hundred wins. That's a, that's you know that's Hall of Fame. You know you can kind of use that as one of your benchmarks, right? But these days I feel like for a lot of young pitchers in the last five years or so going forward, I don't think that's the benchmark anymore. All right, next box. Good luck. Oh, off the wall, Carantini. Now we've got Jacob Nix. Two color dual relic autograph. For the Padres, that's going to be for Matthew Bodner. There's Jesus Aguilar for the Brewers. And there's Bat Kings, Chris Bryant for the Cubbies. That goes to Andrew with the Cubs. Game used material as well, Andrew. Nice. Vlad Guerrero Sr. Right. Right, let's get, a, get some focus here. Kyle Tucker. And there's Justice Sheffield. All right. There it is, our final six boxes. There's four in the back, two on in the front. Good luck, everybody. Halfway through the break. Make some good time here. We've got more Pick Your Teams of Diamond Kings in the store, ladies and gentlemen. So we want to run this back. The next one will be from a fresh case. And it looks like it's going to be our last master case. So the next two breaks, might, that might be it for Diamond Kings. I don't see any more in the back. So get into it while supplies last.
No, hi Rex. No Rangers yet, I think. What is Rex? What is uh? What is Maynard's? Or anybody in the Midwest? What is Maynard's or Menards? They're sponsoring Pitchcast on NBC Sports Chicago. <laughs> That's on MLB Network for the rest of the world. Yeah, Brian, we were talking about that a little bit earlier, Brian O. Um, that the Braves kind of locked up Albius for pretty cheap. Oh, it's a hardware store. So it's like a Home Depot or Lowe's, says Brian and Andrew. Okay. All right. I know what a Lowe's is and Home Depot. There's Altuve to 25, Gallery of Stars. Oh. There's Chris Shaw. Numbered 86 out of 99 for the San Francisco Giants. Robert Edwards, Silver Stacker with that one. There you go, Rob. The Gallery of Stars, Altuve, going to Thomas Bove and the Strohs. It's pronounced Menards. It doesn't exist out here. I don't have to learn how to pronounce it, Rex. Menards? Menards? <laughs> Well, next time I'm next time I'm in the Midwest, I'll be like, "Yeah, can we go to Maynard's?" And they'll be like, "You're not from around here, are you?" And I'll be like, "Oh, no, I'm not." <laughs> Christian Yelich, Bat Kings for the Brew Crew. John C with the Brewers. Wait, the founder's son is really Paul Menard? The NASCAR driver? Is that true? I know that guy. Oh, yes. I'm, I'm getting yes. All right. No, there'd be no reason for you to lie to me, Josh Pruce. That's some crazy trivia. That, well, it wasn't that didn't NASCAR used to be like the the sport of the people? You know what I mean? But now it's like it's like the sport of like rich kids. I guess that makes sense, right? Like anyone can pick up a baseball bat or a basketball, and you can you can play in the streets, right? Football. But I guess I guess if you're Want to be a race car driver? You have to be like, you have to be able to afford to drive a car, have a car, race it around. But like everyone's the son of somebody. Like Austin Dillon is like, is a Childress, right, or something like that. Next box.
George Brett. Ricky Henderson, the Man of Steel. Kristen Stewart out of 49 for the Tigers. Chris Miller with the Tigers. Rex, do you think I should own a restaurant? Why? I'm already in a high-risk business. Why, why start another high-risk business? Kershaw, autograph, frame, wow. One out of two. Well, how do you like that, Jonathan Best? One out of two, Clayton Kershaw on card autograph. Showtime. Clayton Kershaw. Kersh. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo. That is strong. That's very nice. There's Mike Trout. Kirby Puckett frame. Focus. I think this is also um, last year's 2018. Remember, we're in 2018. 19 now. So that's last year's card. All right, next box. Yeah, Andrew spotted that too. Last year's. All right. Next box. Good luck. So far, so good. Oh, wow, what a pickoff move by Quintana. Why well, put in last year's Rex is asking? It's kind of weird. I, I think they're calling it a, they're calling it like a buyback. I think that's the that's the uh, set. Because we saw we saw a Pedro Martinez one uh, last night. Four out of five Pedro Martinez autograph, and that was from like an even older version of Diamond Kings. There's Miles Straw. Wait, I thought I thought Kershaw's double A start was was solid. Six innings, no earned runs. His triple A start was good too. Yelich. So these cards right here. will be randomized front back. It'll be front back on the randomizer. There's Sean Reed Foley, 42 out of 99 for 
the Blue Jays. Most of these cards are the same teams, though. Just FYI. And your relic is Daniel Murphy. And that's for the Mets. That's for Paul Hutchins and the Metropolitans. Um, I'm sure there are some Nolan Ryans in there. I think the checklist is actually in the item description, Rex. If you scroll down on there, you might be able to find Nolan Ryan. If there is any. Oh, Jason's saying no. What a catch. It would have been a double for Chris Bryant. One, two, three. Three boxes left, folks. And there's Ronald Acuna Jr., two-color dual relic for Patrick Kay and the Braves. And there's Rowdy Tellez for the Blue Jays. That's for Anthony Kay. He's been getting some good playing time lately. Two boxes to go. Good luck, everyone. I don't think anything, well, I see a lot of orders coming. Anything else sold out at the moment, folks? I see 12 orders coming in, but no one has mentioned if anything's gone or not.
Good luck, everybody. Next one. This is pick your team four. The next pick your team will be um, from a fresh master case. There's Aaron Judge. All rise. Jersey Kings, Aaron Judge. Yankees, Kevin Smith. Prism is down to six. Nice. We can do some Prism. Colton wants to uh, get get tomorrow's honors football sold out tonight. I like that, Colton. I think we can hit the ground running tomorrow. We should. We should sell out like we should sell out a ton of them. That way, when we start the day tomorrow, when we get honors in the shop tomorrow, we'll go back to back to back to back. It's a good idea. Jersey and autograph, Carlos Correa. Nice. And that'll be for Thomas Bove and the Astros. There's Anthony Rizzo. Rex, how do I think I'm going to react if I pull that Brady one of two tomorrow? I'll probably be like, boo, cheaters never prosper unless you're Tom Brady. There's Danny Jansen. Got artist proof Johnny Bench. There's Ozzy Albias. Got paid, kinda, today. And the last box. Paul Hutchins needs a Met autograph. We got you a Met something, but I don't think it was an autograph, right? An autograph, all right. Got two hits to go here. One of them are going to be an autograph. Will it be a Metropolitan? Stay tuned. We're going to find out in just a few. Doug Glanville's on NBC Chicago. NBC Sports Chicago. Doug Glanville's doing uh, on-field reporting here. <laughs> Rex saying... If you have an iPad and an iPhone, or if you have two devices, basically, you can listen to me at the same time, and it sounds like I'm in a stadium. Now batting, batting, batting. Number 27, 27, 27. Vladimir, Vladimir, Guerrero, Guerrero. We got Ryan McMahon. Sorry, Paul. Ryan McMahon, four out of 99. To Kevin. Kevin Smith with the Colorado Rockies. Nice. How is the fantasy team looking today, Colton? Thanks for asking. Here's Glaber Day. I am up. 11 and a half points today. Austin Barnes went 0 for 1. Jake Bowers went 1 for 4 with a stolen base. I'm kind of weak on stolen bases. Need some stolen bases. Harrison Bader went 0 for 2, but still had an RBI. Oh, there's some wild pitches there, too. Mookie Betts is 0 for 2. He's got a couple more at bats to go. Schwarber's 0 for 1. Justin Smoke, 1 for 1 with a homer already. Three run homer. 
It's just in smoke. Well, that's why I'm playing today. Sonny Gray had a good start until he left the game early. He had four innings and six strikeouts. He was cruising. And Taylor Ward is your final hit of the box and the break. That goes to the Angels, Jonathan Best. And then I have Joe Musgrove, who I'm watching right now. He's got four innings, four strikeouts, no earned runs thus far. He's at, this game is going by fast, starting the top of the fifth. There you go. There's my, there's my fantasy baseball update. I need steals. I actually need my hitting to, to do a little bit better, too. Pitching's been okay. There's Chris Bryant. Look at that. There's Javier Baez. Ichiro, frame. And that, my friends, is that. There you go. Thanks, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Pick your team four in the books. i pulling some nice stuff out of this Diamond Kings, ladies and gentlemen. The next 12-box break will be from a fresh case. Check it out on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Bye-bye.